Hello Collective, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for your likes, your comments, your shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate them all. <clears throat> it's happened. female in bad health tool and neighbor so there could be somebody in bad health here all right maybe somebody uh business wealthy male's business is in bad health but something is changing somebody said okay sorrow and change and it do say unemployment so somebody can be unemployed they're sad uh, bad health what's bad health Prison. Somebody said somebody might go to jail. What's going on here? Divine spirit. What is the message, please, for the collective? Bad health. What's this bad health? Oh, bad health. Sad news. Somebody's disappointed. A crisis. So some sad news going on. Bad. That's bringing bad health for. This is saying news that somebody is in bad health, okay? A uh, military thief, a thief. Somebody tried to steal something from someone that's in authority and everybody is aware now. Somebody could be relocating. If this, somebody tried to relocate, somebody could even be on the run. They about to go to jail. All right, because something is being given to a mature male. All right, so let's see what's going on. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, what is the message? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, what is the message? So, this somebody that could have got some knowledge they wasn't supposed to. This is sad news. That's why somebody's in bad health. They feel like something wasn't, they didn't know something. It's another thing I'm hearing. Let's see, my loves. Uh, <clears throat> challenges. It says, make a decision to work on inner healing. Caution. Find out more information. Somebody found out somebody was spying on them. Tell the universe what they want. Be patient. All right. So somebody been trying to find out what somebody been doing. Somebody been trying to cause challenges for someone to work on inner healing as well. All right. What's the message? We got commitment. Things is getting serious. And ex someone is expecting a pregnancy. So no. Somebody is in a commitment. So there's challenges in this commitment because somebody doesn't want to have children. It's like, no, I don't want to have a baby with you or... They was expecting growth or somebody was expecting somebody to uh, marry someone. All right. So, hmm. Commitment and pregnancy to an air sign. All right. Somebody, there could be challenges. Somebody could have worked on inner healing. Things is getting serious because somebody could be, someone is expecting an air sign date night. Maybe somebody is about is expecting someone to go on a date or be courting somebody. Yeah, give it time. They'll be back to open their heart. They watching to see if this person's manifestation worked. They could have put distance between them and someone that because they knew this person had a lot of chemistry or feelings for somebody. Cause and it was somebody in the middle trying to sabotage this. All right. Could have been a water sign that was, I guess, mooching off of an earth sign. Take that as a resonate too. But hmm, let's see. Things is getting serious because somebody could be expecting, could be an air sign. Congratulations if you're expecting a child, but somebody's expecting something. What's the air sign? Wherever you are, air sign. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So this is sad news to somebody. If somebody was being generous or somebody you was being generous to could have watched something happen. All right, not standing up for somebody being hurt. 
air sign. Hmm. You could be, somebody could be telling somebody that you're an earth angel or they talking about you being this earth angel if you're an air sign. What's the air sign? What's going on? Or it's an air sign talking about y'all. Take it as it resonates. Air sign. Gemini's Libras and Aquarius. What about air signs? They are not a weird, twisted individual. So somebody tell it. Telling somebody that you're not a weird, twisted individual. Somebody else had a hidden agenda trying to make somebody believe that about you. Air sign. What about the air sign? What about the air sign, Holy Spirit? What about the air sign? Okay. So, somebody could be getting karma. Alright. Somebody about to get a dose of their own medicine. And like somebody receive good karma because somebody's walking away. So, somebody walking away from someone now, somebody found out somebody was not a weird, twisted individual, and they're walking away because they know karma about to hit, and they crying over somebody. Yeah, your light was irritating somebody's demons because they knew somebody wanted to be more than friends, but they wanted to sabotage that for you. Pregnancy. What's the Pregnancy. Pregnancy, please. Ninth house. Higher learning. Poker face. Because somebody knew what somebody was doing for entertainment. And they're being ignored. Because this person tried to hide their emotions with somebody new. And somebody's being ignored now. Because they, yeah. They tried to ignore somebody. Maybe show, not showing emotions. How far somebody went and stood by. Because they was intimidated. All right, by you or by someone. Yeah, pregnancy. False twin. Yeah. So now somebody's being ignor ignoring a false twin for spreading lies that you was copying their style. They or because they see somebody trying to copy your style. Okay. <sighs> okay. Wow. Um, so. Someone was expecting somebody to find this out. <laughs> That's the energy I'm getting. Like, well, they knew this. They was going to find something out with this higher learning. You know, maybe with their own knowledge or their beliefs, okay, of a situation. Somebody know that they was copying you or they wanted to be you. So they started spreading lies, saying you was a false twin, and so people can ignore you, but they can't ignore the fact of your ninth house saying that you're an earth angel. People clearly see that, and this person could be getting karma because either this person convinced somebody to walk away from you, somebody knew you wasn't a weird, twisted individual, and you could have received good karma, and somebody else got karma for walking, getting somebody to walk away from you, and they crying now because they did it for the clout. Things is getting serious now. Why? Commitment. Things are about to get serious or it is serious. Things are getting serious. What's getting serious? Uh, energy drainer. In the reverse. Yeah, whoever she is. Somebody can't drain you for all your, everything you got. Yeah, they feel betrayed. Distorted feminine betrayed somebody and they regret it now. They mad and salty and upset with their little hidden agenda was. They stressed the fuck out. They could be arguing and cussing or somebody cussed them out. They could have gave up a piece of their mind for lying on you. So things is getting serious because this distorted feminine can't drain your energy. And somebody feel betrayed by you, by this person. They in regret for whatever mess they caused. It says someone is regretting uh, what they did to you and how they contributed to the mess. They are stressed out and they could be cussing somebody out because somebody is a role model. You could be a role model or they could be talking real bad about a role model. Just because somebody at a distance had real strong feelings for you. All right. And they met they match when it comes to the second house. Okay. Everything that you own or what you claim or what you got going on in life. Like things is yours or, you know, you doing well too. Maybe this person felt like, um... Somebody could have been trying to compete financially with you, okay? But they can't because you're just as, you know, maybe good as them or you're you're doing well for yourself or something. So somebody is making a decision to work on inner healing. They is wondering, yep, there it is. Fourth house. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, you could have chose to work on inner healing. Earth angel, you could, could somebody could have got a reading about you and somebody know you balling. 
Yeah, and they confident that this person was a hidden enemy because somebody know who you was to them or something. They knew this person wanted to be more than friends with you or whatever the case may be. This is the story that man's going to hear. It's confident here that whatever somebody said is the reason why they get in karma because of the, who you are. And when they got a reading done, because they got a reading done and found out this person really wanted to be more than friends or be in a relationship with this earth angel or something like that. Somebody was wondering why something was so challenging to get next to you. It could have been because of this distorted feminine. All right. Yeah, they all had it. Somebody had a hidden agenda, whoever this person was, when it came to a role model. So somebody had a hidden agenda to begin with. So, of course, they was going to lie on y'all. Okay? They said you was a weird, twisted individual. They said you was crazy or something. Come to find out, you was perfectly fine. Also, somebody knows that if you, you are about to get in a commitment with someone... Y'all could be, and they afraid they're going to have a child with you. And somebody really crying about that. I don't know who or why they would be crying about that. But they definitely crying about that. <laughs> they don't want somebody to have a a life with you. Somebody don't want something for somebody. They're a hater. <laughs> this is what I'm getting. Somebody's a fucking hater. They don't want somebody to have you or have better than them or... Some goofy shit like that. But this is really bringing somebody health issues or something. Sad news. Like, oh, like, snot boogies. Like, girl, sit down. Yeah, somebody could be a sewer mate, you know, that's really, like, crying about something. Okay. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. What is the message from my collective? Okay. What's the message right now? What does the collective need to know? What y'all need to be aware of? Okay. Sad news. Okay. You must choose. So they said about somebody's choice. Somebody made a decision. You must choose. Two kittens. So they're afraid that they're going to choose you? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody feel like casting out, like, oh, I feel abandoned, like you don't love me, all right, like, somebody feels casted away, like, so somebody made a choice, and they is melting, whoever this distorted feminine is, she is melting, okay, whatever somebody's choice was, yeah, they casted this person out because they don't, they can't trust this person, they feel like, yeah, well, you know, what else, Holy Spirit? What else is the message for the collective? Okay, well, yeah, whatever magic she was doing or whatever this is, is magical cleaning space. That energy she was on or her energy has been, shoot fly, don't bother me. Energy, yeah. Wow, release your power. So, something has been released. I, it's like an energy of, if somebody was sending negative energy or they was doing work on you, it's like everything is breaking and you're being released. Your energy is being released or something has been released for you. And this has knocked somebody off like kilter though. Yeah, your ancestors said release your, uh, release your power, your ancestral wisdom. Yeah, because somebody was trying to make it hard for you to use your imagination or to get a download. Now it's cleanup time. Whatever this sewer maiden was doing. Or so you would see somebody. Ha. See, this is where they fucked up at. You're an earth angel. You don't see with your eyes. You see with your heart. It's a difference. They can't do that. They can't block your heart from seeing. So you see with your heart. You don't see with your eyes. They're trying to block your crown or your third eye. <sighs> this person damn sure wasn't powerful enough to do all three. <laughs> Um, but they couldn't obviously block you at all because you're an earth angel and due to your inheritance, something is attached to you, a luxurious lifestyle, um, having a business, um, following in your ancestor footsteps. Okay. When it comes to, you know, uh, building, um, things or buying land, um, to help the community, whatever you're doing 
it's all going to come full circle. And somebody was trying to stop that, okay? And somebody feel betrayed by this person, okay? Because they trusted her or something, or you trusted her. Take it as it resonates. They getting karma, though, for what they did, though. You best believe it. Damn. Unending sadness of looking back on what they did. Seriously. Because somebody now is like, I know you're a liar, and I'm not going to let fear stop me this time. They had somebody scared or, or something. Now it's magical cleaning space. Something been cleared away. Maybe somebody had someone. You, either they had you scared of someone or they had them scared of you. Or y'all both were scared of each other or something. Like, you know, whatever. It's been cleared away. I don't know. What's the message here? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. What is the message? Yeah. So magical cleaning space. So you had to cleanse your energy. It was okay for you to be alone to do so. Yeah. Because I'll show you who you could trust. So that's how you were able to see how, you know, who you can trust and who you can't. So something has been cleared away. You must choose. Somebody made the right choice because the natural world needs you. And now you're independent and free. Yeah. So somebody could have been sending something to y'all or something. Or trying to invade your space or something like that, y'all. But now you're independent and free. And somebody else is sick about this, literally. The choice somebody made. Two kittens. So now something is being cleared up. Either somebody's getting clear communication about something or some energy is being cleared up. Yep. That you healed your heart. You healed from some sort of heartache and pain. So now you can see clearly with your heart chakra. And this person knows that they got to reconsider their alliances now. Yep, because it's a comment of the chaos. If there was any upheaval, it was orchestrated or it was done by somebody that was a freaking hater of yours. Hmm. And they like, shit. So forgiveness comes with uh, healing your heart, right? If you're able to uh, whatever, live and let go or... Um, it is what it is energy, no hard feelings. If there, it's like a lot of things that come with that. And somebody was hoping that you wouldn't get to that point because that would mean it would be too challenging for them to touch anything in your fourth house and everything that you own and everything that you had or something like that would be protected as you go through your spiritual awakening. Y'all could have been on this spiritual journey for a while you just started at the end of the day somebody is seeing you like damn like you're about shit is about to grow you on this this empress energy because you have clarity now in this situation hmm and now they're crying because somebody walked away from them but that's their karma <laughs> it's like that's their karma that's what the that's what they wanted somebody to do to you and now somebody walked away from their ass and with this change, apparently somebody's finances could be improving. Okay. So, so finances is improving now. Yeah, behind the scenes. Somebody is seeing it. Um, if somebody tried to disconnect somebody from their fourth house or from uh, their inheritance, it's like they've been reconnected or something like that. And things is getting better for you. Behind the scenes, somebody don't know that. They didn't see that coming or something like that. Yeah, because somebody was obsessed with you. I don't know. Shh, don't tell nobody. Yeah, wow. They was obsessed with getting you fired or getting you to lose something that's yours. That allows you to live comfortably. That's too challenging now. This distorted feminine is crying now. What's going on? Well, you know, shit. Somebody also wanted it to be too hard for you to pour into yourself every day. That's another thing. Somebody is hard. It's like, ah, uh, like they they work on, they heal themselves every day. They, they actually take the time out to meditate. They actually take the time out to rest. They actually take the time out to invest in themselves. Like I said, if you are, if you got your own projects that you're doing, your own business, you, you take your time and behind their, the scenes, they could have thought like, Oh, I don't see so-and-so. So, or, or they was late to do this the whole time you was doing something else to build yourself. Like you got so many ideas, you got so much going on and these things are about to come to fruition. And somebody else was, uh, on a flip of this. Okay. 
your arch nemesis, <laughs> that's what we're gonna call this individual. Um, they was trying to like, I mean, hella focus, like, like how you do that, like a sleight of hand. So a card trick, okay, like you know how somebody focus, you ever seen somebody focused on trying to watch somebody hands or something like that as well? Or somebody could be watching your hands. I don't know what the hell they got to do with anything, but um they thought they were doing something and it's just like oh so that wasn't working or something wasn't what it is whatever they thought they were in their own their own illusion i feel like whoever this is because they couldn't see your hand they thought you were showing their hand but the reflection they were seeing was something else i don't know what they were seeing okay yeah, now this person that was trying to catfish someone, they feel binded to their current situation. Why? Right. Whatever happened around New Year's, because of what they did around New Year's, they feel binded now. Maybe since New Year's, because they was lying. Somebody lied and hid the hidden, had hidden truth about your life purpose it has a lot to do with level ups. As you grow, it's like they can't stop you from leveling up. This is like, like you... Your shoes get your feet getting bigger, you know, you know, when you get older, your children and shit like that, you, you got to keep buying different sneakers. You can't keep a child that's in a size 10. You can't buy them another six. Like what the fuck? They not going to fit. So that's another energy. That's why something is like so bad on somebody. Something just don't fit no more. Okay. It don't fit. The energy somebody was doing here, that's why it's binded to them because it's, it's their size, right? That's how big they feel of themselves, how they see themselves. Somebody been lying. Oh, somebody know this person was lying and shit. Had hidden motives and everything else. What else? Now they feel binded to something because you were supposed to already, like right now, they was expecting you to be ten, ten, 10 of swords, 10 of wands, like really struggling, scraping pennies or like if you had a business, nothing in your business was going right for you. You know, like they was expecting to just sit back and see that. And they like, wow, ain't none of that happened. So-and-so still doing good. Like, wow. So they regret doing whatever the fuck they did now. Like, I don't know why they thought something was working, but. I don't know. Somebody really thought something was working at a point, whatever point this was. Whoever the copycat is, is really out of whack right now. Since New Year's, this copycat been trying to cause imbalances. It just didn't work. And they're the ones getting imbalanced. Okay? Maybe this person wanted your energy... They wanted to be you or something. Yeah, they don't even have protection. So, and the phase came to an end of them being able to astral project to your energy. You know, that then came to an end. Thank God. Everybody, maybe this whole group, see that you actually grew from a situation. Because you're being, and now they're being guided to end something completely. Because access is denied. They need to proceed with caution. They should have paid attention around Thanksgiving. They could have got some signs in November that yeah, this wasn't the right way to go. Okay. But arrogance got them here. Okay. And I wish they just let y'all grow here and evolve for Pete's sake. Yeah, this non-professional energy, they're worried now. Okay. This also is giving like somebody knowing that they was trying to cause problems with you or problems for you. They're trying to, they could have tried to do it in a sly way. Like, don't nobody know that they throwing this to you or that they talking about you or... <laughs> something weird like that I don't know very strange energy
Yeah, we got a copycat. Someone is mocking everything you do and failing at it, by the way. Because they thought, like, well, shit. Like, okay, so, so, like, remember I said watching they get hands. What? So, somebody could have been watching how you were doing something, and they thought that they can just, that's how you do it. I'm going to just copy off how you lay, like, if you're their reader, I'm going to copy out how you lay your cards out, you know, and I'm going to just go like that. And I'm going to just pretend this is that and a third. Maybe if I put uh some angel numbers behind my name, then X, Y, and Z, something weird, y'all. <laughs> Like, this is the energy somebody was on. It's like they tried to be you. And maybe somebody knows this. And they tried to excommunicate you or get you kicked out of something. And it's like, how? Like, the natural world needs you. All right? I don't know who this other person is or what they was on. But people have made their choice. This could even be people in the public eye or people in the public, maybe your community. They made their decision. Who they who they choosing? They choose you, the authentic one, not the copycat. Also, if this is like a relationship, somebody choose you, not the copycat, not the fake, not the karmic twin flame. They want the real twin flame kind of energy. Okay. Let's see what the copycat got going on. This copycat is not satisfied. They are pissed. They can't be, they might be having nightmares or they don't have sweet dreams. It's a lot of conflict going on. <clears throat> They're not satisfied with this competition. They could have been competing with y'all. What's the copycat that's not satisfied, not having good dreams? What about the copycat? Wow, this is an arrogant family member? Okay. So they not having sweet dreams, okay? Because somebody was being arrogant about a your home or about your background or because of your background or because of something, okay? Maybe that's why somebody overindulged in something. They didn't want to hear it. Okay, it's like somebody trying to Take your inheritance and shit like that. Yeah. They thought everything was okay when you was casted away. They would get your blessings. But now also somebody about to find out what this family did. So a family could have got you casted away or wanted you homeless. And people are seeing that. Like they was okay when you was messed up. Like, it was like, it was none of this somber energy when you was, like, casted out or when you was homeless or when they abandoned you or when they, whatever. So, somebody, it could be somebody in your family. They were happy. People visually seen this person happy when you was messed up. But now you're not. It's like, oh, no, they got to see you messed up now. Or they tried their best to put you out there. Maybe because they were pretending to be you. So, when you was homeless and messed up, that's not Empress energy. That's not, not saying, you know, you could have been pre-Empress, you know, or when you was casted out or when you was failing, it was done by spell work from family members behind the scene that was trying to be you. Okay? And they would get your blessings and stability and everything else and everything would be fine. But this family was being arrogant. And now they're not satisfied. No, nope, like the, this copycat didn't cut it because now that you're in your empress or emperor energy, they see a lot, especially if you're an empress, they see the growth around you. Because the empress, they shit grow around the empress. Right? Yeah. Because you loved yourself. You're and you did it by yourself. The reason why something is so sturdy for you is because you did it alone. This person could be off balance. This person know why something was off balance. This coach. Because you are at peace. Okay. So they could even try to coach somebody to cause imbalances in your life. Uh-huh. Yeah. So somebody tried to coach somebody to take your blessings or take something from you. 
and they lost a third wheel enemy yeah pretend to be their friend pretend something and they lost yeah this idea to do whatever they did they could have lost this sweetheart okay you could be that sweetheart energy they lost you mm-hmm because yeah they would have had to separate you from your blessings so somebody could have know that this person was planning to rob you and they thought luck was on their side a whole community online community to separate you from something but you loved yourself or because you you're you did something alone you have support so because you did something by yourself that's that's that that whole saying like i love like different songs different things um when they said uh i think drake said it he said, I got favor because nobody saved me. That's what happens when you when you make it through um, some real tough trials and tribulations. The the price go up in the ethers for like for you, a.k.a. like you really get everything you deserve when nobody saves you. Right. These is the people that have run to some. Oh, I need y'all help. I can't do it by myself. Oh, I need help with this. I don't know how to build this. Can you like help me with this and help me with that? And these is the people that wanted you to be rejected. And that's okay because you, it worked in your favor because nobody saved you. <laughs> that's why everything is working out for you. And God is you know, like, it is what it is. You did it by yourself. That's how it go. What's this? New Year's. So something happened around New Year's. What about New Year's? We got binding contract. So they could have been committed to doing something around New Year's. Or yeah, to a sweetheart. Or they was trying to bind you. <sighs> New Year's. What about New Year's? Maybe somebody tried to put a contract on a sweetheart energy. Yeah, but you can be at peace because somebody got proof and evidence that you persevere through all challenges. This ally, so you they were you were being watched. Okay, so ally got proof that you actually persevere through all the challenges. Okay, and we got binded. So we got feeling binded to the current situation. Somebody feels binded to a current situation right now. Because they have no support at all. Yeah. They don't have no friends with gifts. That's spiritual gifted or any of that. They don't have friends with these type of gifts. Okay. Yeah. Because they over overstay their welcome or they overindulged here. Yeah. Because these people, the gift is with the origin where the gifts lie is in somebody's Akashic records or due to the ancestors or something like that. And maybe their ancestors, y'all ancestors told somebody to reject this person. Yeah, they told them to withdraw. So, yeah, because you get to have inner peace. And somebody is suffering now and worried that everything was just an illusion. You know, yeah, like I said, they thought something was working out. I don't know, man. Somebody thought something was really working out for their eyes good or... They was getting their way with you, but it was not happening. They was in an illusion, all right? Shit, wow. They feel binded to something due to your origin. Or the origin or the nature of what this is. But you learn, you live and you learn about overindulging with trying to curse someone with misfortune. The origin of cursing. So whatever this, uh, they overindulge with trying to curse somebody with misfortune out of their ego. And the origin of that, where that comes from. So it's giving... Like uh, death energy, dis-ease. Um, it could cause a lot of complications to a person that's not gifted. And you don't know how to cleanse your energy. 
So these friends that they were working with, it's in their region, their origin, like they were born into this type of darkness. And now this person want to compromise because it ain't work out the way they thought. Yeah. Now they begging for mercy, you say, child. Due to the origin, somebody is asking for God for help. Please, Lord, help me. Energy. That's what somebody on. Because somebody was not who they appear to be. Catfish. Who is this? Oh, boy. They sorry. They quit. They feel guilty. Somebody is so confused. Why would they take this vow or what they was worshiping now? You mean to tell me? <laughs> they didn't know they was worshiping the devil when you trying to curse or hex somebody. God doesn't curse or hex anyone, baby. Okay? God will give you karma. But he will not specifically target an area. And that's, that's what's a part of your lesson. You learned the lesson of poverty or homelessness or being left out in the cold. You learned something all on your own. All right. Now I'm this person that feel like, oh, they lied. They tricked me. They catfished me. I'm sorry, Lord, please help. I didn't know I was worshiping the devil. This could be allegedly somebody that believe in, you know, a higher power. Okay. And now their rebuttal is that they didn't know that they was worshiping the devil. Okay. Trying to hex or curse somebody. That's not of the light. God doesn't do revenge tactics. Like, so you don't even know God. So how can you, whatever. Catfish. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Yeah. So they sorry now. Because... <laughs> This, I told you somebody could be religious, libations. They can donate it to this third will enemy that was doing death magic. A curse could have came to a complete end if they did a curse over you from this person. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, it's over. This conflict fight is over. They could be going through some supernatural disturbances, but you live and you learn about who you worship in. The reason why you have inner peace is because you love yourself. Because you take time to tap in. Because you don't know it all. Ain't that beautiful? Not being a know-it-all? That means that you get to learn something new every day. Life isn't boring. Like, <laughs> So this person is a know-it-all. They thought they knew something or whatever. And they want to play the, I didn't know, Lord. What was your intent behind it? Let's go there. See, this is how this person need to understand why this karma about to really kick that ass, okay? What was your intention? I don't care if you didn't know what the magic, who, what, it, what, what origin it stemmed from. What was your intention? Your intention was to rob somebody. Your intention was to take something from somebody. Your intention was to make somebody poor, broke, busted, and disgusted. Now, how is that of God? Intention is everything. You must choose the light or the dark. You could have, they could have chose the dark. Okay, that's the place you're going. Then understand. Then it's no, it's it's sickness and dis-ease over there. Okay. Get what you want, you know, do your thing. Uh -huh. Yeah, this is a queen of pentacles, a matriarch. This could be your grandmama. This could be um, something like that. Lost, this, called, this, this deck is called the Lost Souls Tarot. So if it doesn't, have, the person doesn't have a face. So the matriarch of this connection, this older woman, this grandmother, this lost a soul for money. Oh, or they sold a shit. 
That's wild that I would even pick this card, this deck up. And that wasn't what suppo was supposed to happen this lifetime or something. That's wild. So somebody, yo, somebody tried to sell they somebody for money, child. Is this the devil or the magician? Oh my. They was what they was doing. They done sold they sold, Lord. Lord of mercy. <laughs> yeah, but this magician couldn't uh they could have been doing this for a long time trying to do something for money lord have mercy wherever the earth angel is uh you could be rebalancing something when it comes to your fourth house because it was too challenging for your lineage to heal they need you yo your ancestors they're they're just like you need them they need you yeah, but they knew that this earth angel, as soon as you arrived, as soon as you woke up or something, that you would be living this great life if you helped your ancestors clear this karma. And you could have helped your ancestors and your spirit guides clear karma. And this other person in your family that tried to be you, which was a dark soul in the first place, they thought by casting you out of the family or casting you away from your family or having a family, maybe uh, distorting your North Node, because maybe your North Node has a lot to do with children or having getting pregnant or something like that. Somebody knew that when they was pregnant with an air sign, okay? Somebody knew this is your mama. Somebody knew when they was pregnant with you, okay, that you was here to change this uh, dynamic here. Okay, so it might get it's this so this could be even your mama that's that sold her soul at one point. At the only point, because you only get one, <laughs> right? For some money. All right. They could have even tried to sell you to the highest bidder when it came to practitioners to drain your energy as a child. And they could have got paid for these types of things. This is a kind of mama that sell their kids. Like you was a weird bitch for that. But okay. Like, how you going to put price tags on your babies? But for you, since you was an earth angel, they thought their pockets was going to be full. Because they knew you was the earth angel. They knew that you was next up. So they, you know, could have tried to cause a lot of challenges for you after all the abuse they put you through to heal so you never become this role model. Wild. Okay? Absolutely wild. That's what I'm getting. Okay? And it's been going on for a long time. Mm, and somebody's scared now. Because somebody know that you know the truth. Or somebody is getting the message. Ooh. Well, I mean. Oh, <laughs> judgment. To this queen of wands. So somebody made a bad decision. Your mother could be a fire sign. They under judgment, baby. Let's see, y'all. What's this? Because I'm feeling a matriarch or somebody older. All right. Could even be a sister or something. Let's see. What's the message here? It's coming towards my collective. What y'all got going on here, my loves? Let's see. Check out judgment. Okay. Period. It's the reckoning. This is the final decision from the universe. Final call to rain down on earth. Kind of rain down on these people. Okay. Burn everything in sight. Energy you see on that fire. <laughs> it looked like he got a torch in the other hand just burning shit. He already got the, the message with the staff in his hand. Somebody is under judgment, bad judgment, bro. So this is a tower moment to this person. And he looking down like, yep. Now, remember in the other deck when it's judgment? Oh, so they don't get their soul back. So remember in the other deck, remember the souls of resurrection it, all around this angel? These souls is getting burnt. So they're being casted away to the hellfires for the, for the duration, for the re remainder of all eternity. Whoever these people are, 
They lost their soul and it's being burnt in, you know, the fire, basically. Damn, Archangel Michael says. Ten of Pentacles, because they sold their shit. It could be ten souls. Maybe somebody in your family, Ten of Pentacles. They also, the final judgment has came for who the inheritance go to, who it belonged to. Yeah, somebody noticed Page of Swords and they scared because they tried to, they could feel like they, they wanted to win at all costs, but you still got victory and success due to God himself. Said what he said for a wine. Something came to light that something is yours, fourth house. Well, mm-hmm. <clears throat> God's coming in. Shit. I'll tell you what's going on. The page of swords. So this is information. Somebody spying. Somebody could be could be a younger air sign. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. And a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, a King of Cups. That don't have no other choice but to stop. Because you're independent and free. And this emperor is now bored with some sort of religion. Okay, or bored with some sort of rules when it comes to them uh, it being flighty to a two of cups. So somebody's standing their ground and not doing that no more. Somebody don't want to be flighty with a two of cups situation or something is about to speed up for the two of cups situation because somebody now is not interested in some sort of rules anymore. Yeah, so if somebody tried to Oh, you can't do this. Somebody watch me do it. The fuck you talking about? <laughs> Something like that, y'all. Uh, what's the obstacle here for this person, yo? The seven of cups. They can't cause an illusion. They can't cause no more illusion. Somebody see clearly now. Yep. These three people or these friends, this group, they can't cause an illusion to this person. Here's a reason to celebrate. And the outcome. Wow. We're going to look at both of these. All right, before. Ace of Wands. Wow. The Death card in the King of Cups. This could be a Scorpio of significance here. All right. Yep, Eight of Wands. Because somebody already heard the message or the news. Something is moving very quickly. Somebody could be having a brand new passionate beginning here. All right. Somebody could be coming out of the cold. Yep, taking this leap of faith, coming out of the cold. All right. And that's their justice to take this leap of faith and come out of the cold and have a brand new passion at the beginning. Somebody's very passionate about this or somebody's very passionate about you. So somebody's coming out of the cold here, coming out of poverty, coming out of being uh, excommunicated or just coming out of something, y'all. Coming out of something. Five of Pentacles in the reverse. No more lack. Yeah, because somebody could have been lying to someone to get them go in a new direction or something. Somebody thought they got away with something until they found out the truth online. Somebody could have got text messages, emails, something like that. There's judgment. What about the judgment, Holy Spirit? Somebody's under judgment, period. Oh, wow. Four of swords. Something is being laid to rest. Yeah. Four of swords. Period. Yep. Because somebody's moving forward or you had the structure and dis discipline queen of swords. You could have very much so the tools, the right tools that you needed to move forward or something. Now that things are being laid to rest, you get to move forward. It's like your chariot awaits. Okay. That's the energy I'm getting. Your chariot awaits. And somebody is hella pissed, man, that you are this hierophant, man. Yeah, your chariot awaits. We got the king of wands. Okay. Definitely is not confused about who they got feelings for. Yeah. And nobody can make them avoid coming towards you. Yeah. Somebody didn't want somebody to have a long-term investment with you, Empress. Now something is over with this three of swords energy. Okay. So somebody really tried to... Uh, cause you some sort of pain like somebody wanted you to be heartbroken about something okay make sure all of these is in the upright 
All right. Yeah, but now there's some sort of balance and harmony being restored. King of Wands. You could be a King of Wands. It has structure and discipline now or something like that. Something could be about a vehicle as well. Yeah, this is your karmic justice, though. Temperance and justice. This is balance, harmony, reconciliation, and karmic justice. This is what you desire, what you deserve. Okay, not desire, but what you deserve. Something is what you deserve. It's a chariot here. Yeah, six of pentacles moving forward. They know you're going to have something. You're getting your wish fulfillment. They know this. What's the page of swords? Because somebody's spying. Okay, they're always in y'all business. They love being in your business. All right, shit. What's the page of swords? Is somebody watching you receive something or they about to watch you receive something. Yeah, so somebody is knowing now, spying. They know they missed the opportunity. Four of Cups. Because somebody, they, somebody, a passion has ignited. I don't know. <laughs> So it's a missed opportunity. Somebody passion has ignited. Yeah. And there's a tower moment that you single. So I don't know if somebody was expecting you to be in a horrible relationship or something or just down bad. I don't know why this person was expecting it, but somebody shocked to see you single, self-sufficient and independent and something came to light. So whoever this is, this could have been. Somebody that was, they was bored. They didn't want to have relations with or something. Maybe this is her. Somebody don't want to sleep with this person as well. Because their passion is ignited somewhere else. What's the Ace of Wands? Six of Wands. I'm telling you, Ten of Cups. Whatever this is, it's going to make somebody so happy. And it's about to happen very quickly. What's this? Ace of Cups. Yes, child. Look at that. Two of Cups. Yeah, I don't know what this person, somebody thought that this person missed a beat, but they didn't. You're single, you're there single, somebody's single, I don't know. And they're going to have victory and success to have this happily ever after. Ace of Cups, Two of Cups, Ace of Wands, this is really fucking good energy. What? Because this connection comes with the Ace of Pentacles. In the near future, somebody has already made a decision to make an offer here. And make a practical decision to close out lies, close a, close a cycle of a liar, or close out a cycle with somebody that was lying. Because Seven of Cups, somebody could be confused, or they can't cause an illusion anymore. Yep, because karma is playing out. This is karmic justice. For a cycle to be over, and for something new to begin. What's justice? What's justice, please, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit? The Knight of Pentacles. So something coming to light would took so long for this two of cups situation to happen. And they have regret. Because maybe they just partnered up with a Queen of Pentacles for a while. I don't know. They regret now. Like being there. Knight of Pentacles could be a Virgo. What's the Knight of Pentacles? Yeah, so their little plan to block somebody, it, it didn't work. Because somebody put in the work. Somebody actually is doing the work now. So they get to come out of somebody also just playing to block your work. And that didn't work. Five of Pentacles in the reverse. You coming out of the cold now? Yep. This is how somebody emerging out of the cold. Nine of Pentacles. Self-sufficient and independent. Ready for this four of wands energy with the star. You. Yeah, this is definitely a strong connection here with the lovers. Strength in the lovers. This could be past life soulmate energy. You could be this strong earth angel here with a past life soulmate here that's still... Hopeless, romantic, somebody sorry for the wait, okay? It's like, sorry for the delay, babe, okay? Energy, I don't know, y'all. So something could be changing. What's the nine of pentacles? Tower, yeah, somebody like, oh my God. What's the tower? The truth coming out that somebody know the truth. Yep, and somebody is blocking somebody now or defending somebody. Take it as it resonates. What is this? Yeah, they stopping somebody for trying to sabotage you, all right? Or stopping somebody from trying to sabotage you. All right, here we go. The Queen of Wands. Yeah, this is a tower to the Queen of Wands. Now, they know exactly who got them locked up. 
Man, why is somebody hit it? Now this younger fire sign could be scared or something. Who the queen of wands? So this is a tower. Okay. About a queen of pentacles. They found out the truth about this queen of pentacles in the reverse. She came out sideways a little bit. Maybe the queen of wands and the queen of pentacles partnered up. But somebody found out the truth. This person taking a leap of faith. An emperor. I don't know. They already told a friend. And this is heartbreaking. They, been, they was heartbroken about the past. All right, because of this King of Cups and a selfishness or something like that. Or somebody wished that they was a King of Cups in the past, but now they are. Take it as it resonates. All right, somebody could be an Aries. Yeah, they was afraid you was going to reject them. So somebody was afraid that Aries was going to reject them or Aries was afraid somebody was going to reject them. Yeah, because somebody, a narcissist knew that somebody had an unfinished business in love with a fire sign. So the fire sign could be an Aries. Somebody could have a Challenger, Hellcat, a BMW, Subaru, Toyota, Mazda, whatever that is. Okay. Let's see. What's the message? <sighs> yeah, this person may be no longer a part of an organization no more, or they are. Them hexes and curses is backfiring on them. Somebody couldn't stop missing you. Yeah, a fake friend knew that, eh? They knew that you couldn't stop missing somebody. All right, we got a dad as well. Okay, it could be an Aquarius father. I don't know. So somebody's dad knew that somebody couldn't stop missing you. This man could have a shortcut, deep waves. They couldn't get over you at all. And it could be a woman involved here with, with dreads or braids. Yeah, that it was just sex, nothing more. So, yeah, they don't have no unfinished business in love with a water sign. Okay, the police is watching that water sign, wherever that is. They got some issues going on. Because somebody knew they had unfinished business in love with an air sign, and they didn't want that to happen. Z, they wasn't trying to hear that shit. Yeah, somebody neighbor had an unhealthy obsession with them. In. Yeah, but somebody wasn't single or they was single five years ago. Yeah, and somebody that's still in love with you, they can't hide it no more. Okay? Or they couldn't hide it anymore. Or somebody knew this person was still in love with you, but they couldn't hide it. Or they was trying to hide it, but they can't. Something. We got I. Yeah, they tried to catfish you. You knew it was them. They wouldn't know what's your new number. They about to learn a hard lesson because they know what you did. They know... They about to learn a hard lesson because somebody found out they found out that what they did to this person. The Fed had the feds watching somebody. They know they created a mess and they only hoping somebody can help them fix it. Yes, they lied to somebody about everything. Somebody mom or aunt. They both getting karma. Return to sender times 10 due to a grandmom. Yeah. Damn. Because somebody knew somebody was in love with you for real, for real. Yeah, B. J and B. Sagittarius. All right. You could be a high priestess or something. Somebody knew somebody was in love with a high priestess. They knew that shit. Okay. Yeah. Libra. Monday, 10 years ago. So you might know this person for a long time. Let's see. What happened here? Somebody see you looking good in your pictures in the fall. Somebody was doing death spells on you. That's wild. See that shit? Hating and shit. They was trying to invoke fear. They can't now. Somebody not scared no more. God is blocking all negative energy projections. Exactly. From a Scorpio that don't that they don't want to bring they spend a the night bag with. They didn't lose you for good. They know you 100% heterosexual, male or female. Black, a black man or a woman is 100% heterosexual. Somebody could have said somebody was bisexual. No. That's another thing. Uh, some people crazy. Somebody beauty spells didn't work on you. So they was trying to affect your beauty as well. On a Thursday. Child. Yeah, because they knew who the true emperor was. <laughs> what? If you're reading this, it's too late. Everybody knew how pressed this person was about you. Q, that's stalking you. They were stalking your ass. What else? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. 
They want to be because they knew somebody wanted to be with you bad as hell. So what could they do? Stop this person from trying to come towards you. That's what they thought a year ago. Okay. Why? I don't know. In the wintertime. G. Three years ago. This person was doing a lot. Okay. With this whatever. All right. I hope this helped you guys.